lovelies welcome back to my channel I appreciate you stopping by how are you guys doing today so I have a fun video for you but before we jump into the video please do not forget to like like and subscribe and leave a comment and I want to thank all my new subscribers hey I see you and if this is your first time seeing me welcome please do not forget to subscribe and for all my returning subscribers hey 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 how are you guys doing thank you so much for joining today and I really appreciate you so I have a very you know one of our videos comparison video luxury comparison video yes ma'am so I've decided to compare between two of my gorgeous gorgeous bag nope it's the other way around my YSL bag and my Chanel boy bag Ooh, what a blessing look at this gorgeousness going out here hey 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 so um let's as you know i just uploaded a video with what fit in this lovely gorgeous baby here and hey loves hey love how are you and today i want to take the things in this bag and put them in my ysl bag and tell you which one i think is i don't want to say better because they get in their different ways they work differently for me so i really don't want to say which one is better but from my whatever like the details of each bag then it's up to you to decide which one you think you will get first in your collection before the other just in case okay so this is the chanel boy bag with the god hardware exterior all leather interior has um, a little clap to open this bag you clap you press this two here right here this two here you press it and you lift up to this gorgeousness is a a one flap handbag and i already thought you know the things inside because i just did what fit in my bag <laughs> Okay, so it has it op opens up to this green lining, green cloth lining, and has just a pocket right here. Just gorgeous, gorgeous bag. Very expensive. You got six thousand or close to six thousand dollars. Yeah, but that's not what I got it for because I got it pre love. But just such a gorgeous, gorgeous bag. It is mainly used for like if you're you're like fashion is like i think it can go for anything i don't just think it's only if your dressing is ed edgy or whatever because um you can wear this for dinner or so you could also wear it for like casual and all of that so i think it's really nice what well, you know date night and casual wear really really pretty just doesn't hold enough okay but very expensive and why you gotta know that the leather um with chanel with this bag this area tend to collapse and this flap here tend to you know uh coiling just i want you to know that and a lot of people have complained this is supposed to be adjustable no you can adjust it i don't think um I think you can but i don't think it's necessary but anyways people complain that this here pulls their hair so just FYI it hasn't done for me but just letting you know as I told you you can wait on your shoulder like that you can wear crossbody or you can wear single shoulder you know I'm 5'4 and the length is stopped at a good length right there just such a gorgeous gorgeous bag okay that is my first bag the second one i'm going to be comparing it with is this ysl sunset in medium medium size and it has that logo i've had this for the past three years or four years i'm going to do an updated um a wear and tear of this bag but i've had this baby for a long time and she's just been amazing as i tell you exterior or leather comes in this accordion style does not have fit, feet my chanel bag doesn't have feet also 
this is magnetic closure and the magnetic in this case me has been scaring me from the moment i got my hand on this bag till now i'm still scared of it because i feel like the pull the way it pulls is going to pull the thing out of the ladder but it hasn't so far and i haven't seen anywhere but it is really hard let me bring it closer so you can see see how amazing the ladder still looks such a gorgeous bag and there's no creasing here with the boy bag there's creasing where you have it here you see a lot of creasing here but i don't really like do my you know overdo my bag i just leave it like this and if i have to search for something i just like you know look a more hole here than bend this all over that's just me that's how i wear my bag anyways um the interior of this oh it still have stuff in it i'm gonna go ahead and i i stop i stop stop my bag and this is the dust bag to this one so the interior is in this uh what would you call it um this is suede what do you call the new suede now like a suede color but it's in three compartment mind you my boy bag is one command compartment this is three has three one one compartment two and three so this one also have a pocket on the back my my boy by my boy bag doesn't it comes in this chain but mostly the chain uh, my boy bag have half and half half like that half chain this one just have this little attached uh, thing the ladder to this is really solid really really thick and nice and i love love this bag yes 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 so what fit in this bag this price retail for are still under 2500 the last time i check we check because ysl did have a price increase so i'm gonna go ahead and take out all the things in this bag and put them in the other bag okay okay i'm gonna go ahead and put these things that i got in this my bag so i have my compost pass from wires uh from wires so from louis vuitton my phone you know what i put my phone right here i put it i put it in a bag and then my sunglasses And I'm gonna go ahead and put my little thing. I'm trying not to stretch the bag so much. So this is I have my phone over there. I can put my phone to the back for easier access. I have my sunglasses and my perfume samples. I can put my uh drop my hand sanitizer on top. I don't really like to carry hand sanitizer like that so that they don't pour on my bag or anything like makeup so they don't stain my lining so i'll just leave my sanitizer in the car put my mask and then my wallet my compass is over there and this is how it looks after let's close it and see and am i doing yeah that's it it's close and this is it this is more heavier than the boy bag because the ladder of this is heavier the chain is also heavy even though the um chain <coughs> though the chain on the boy bag is chunkier this one is heavier 
I don't know if you understand. Oh, this, it is heavy. This this bag is just you know, um, but it's not like it's not gonna kill you heavy. And to wear it, see, and you can wear it on your shoulder, and you can wear it. Baby. Yeah, they stop the same place and mind you the chain on this don't dig my skin but your skin probably will be different my skin is very tough <laughs> um and so far this uh one from the boy bag having dig yet but that doesn't mean that it won't with you it, it won't okay i'm just putting it out there it, ha it has not done on my skin i don't know how fragile how you know your skin is so but bear that in mind so that is what um what i'm going to say about these two bags this leather on this bag is very sturdy The leather on this here is even though it's caviar is not as sturdy as this i can see this lasting longer than this and from what i've heard so far this wear faster than this will so just letting you know i've told you i'm trying not to say buy this but buy this you know first <laughs> i'm just saying okay but this are my two i just i don't want one to be jealous i want to feel like i love the other than the other you know they're my babies so that is my lovely comparison that's these are my bags and i this is the comparison i decided this is the video i've decided to do today so these are my two this are my two gorgeous bag and i hope you guys enjoyed this video let me know which one you think is you know in your in your opinion you think you get first before the other okay so uh, i hope you did enjoy oh this is heavy really heavy but it has things in it i hope you did enjoy this video uh please don't forget to like and subscribe and i will see you in my next bye now